Hey guys, welcome back to the channel. So I just did a live stream. This is Wednesday evening. And in my live stream, I wanted to talk about um, the things that we found out about Call of the Wild on the last dev live stream that was on Tuesday. But unfortunately, I just didn't have a lot of Call of the Wild people in my chat that were really interested in talking about that. So I decided that I'll make a video discussing what it was that uh, I wanted to originally talk about anyway. Um, now, I I realized that I've kind of, you know, not as big of a content creator in, in Call of the Wild anymore, you know, and that's, that's fine. It's probably because I have some of my own unpopular opinions about the game and, and the developers and whatnot, but I don't like to sugarcoat things, and I'm never going to, you know not tell you guys straight up how I feel about something. With that being said, they uh, they did a live stream this week as they, they normally do. And they introduced us into... Into? They introduced us to the new lead game designer. And I must say he's new because he's only been there for a little over a year. Where did those other deer go? Hmm. There's a potential for a level 2 Diamond White Tail over there. I don't think he'll make it. But I figured it'd be a good thing to do for this video. Just to wander on over there and see what we get as I talk about what they discussed in the live stream. So, this new developer, I actually kind of like what he was saying and again I take all this with a grain of salt because I do feel that actions speak louder than words and I think yeah that's that's the herd right there okay there was a couple smaller deer drinking over here so I, I don't feel like that's what we're looking for but anyway he said some things that I like he said some things that I'm not used to hearing EW say or admit and I appreciate that he said some things like there are certain things with the game right now that are completely unacceptable that is something that we have never heard anyone from EW admit okay that that there's things in the game that are unacceptable you know, so that's uh, that's a huge, huge plus for me to hear a developer, you know, make that kind of statement. And let me equip the deer grunt here. I know I have it. <laughs> and I got... Those deer sneaking in behind me, I can hear them. So, obviously, the big thing was bug fixes. There, there's things with the game that they want to fix, and obviously, we all want that. We all want that. We all want the game to be fixed. We all want it to be in a better state, better playable state. And uh, all that good stuff. And I don't think I'm going to get their attention. It says she's traveling? Oh, okay. That is not <sighs> our, our... Uh, okay. That's not the, uh, the big one that we want. Although he is a nice one. There's another one that's even bigger. But, um, so yeah, they're, they're working on, on fixing things and, you know, I'm definitely going to give this guy the benefit of the doubt. He seems pretty cool. They actually hired him from Rockstar. He worked on all the Red Dead Redemptions. He worked on GTA. He worked on Midnight Club. He, he worked on a lot of projects. So he obviously knows what he's doing. So that's a huge plus in my book. 
And some of the things that he talked about was the fact that in uh, early next year, they're going to work on completely redoing all the waterfowl. And not just waterfowl, but ducks and geese, because he said that they're kind of like intertwined together. So, oh, there he is right there. There he is. That's the one we want. That's the one we want right there. So as someone that really enjoys it, he's down. All right. Um, another thing that he mentioned is that, you know, the issue that the Xbox players are having right now, I guess on Xbox, the lag is really horrible. The uh, FPS is dropping right down to a level where it makes the game completely unplayable, which sucks. And he said that, another thing they said that is unacceptable. So the next patch will address that. But on another interesting note that has to do with that, it's not going to just affect Xbox. Apparently, they've been working on it to give all the consoles better performance, which is fantastic. This is something that I personally have been asking about for a long time and never get an answer. I've emailed them about it. I've, I've put it in their Discord. I've tried asking about it on their live streams, and it just gets looked over. So apparently this is something that they do know about. I mean, they have to. People have complained about it. You know, I mean, so <laughs> they uh, they have to know about it. And apparently it's going to get fixed. Again, we'll see. Because if anything with EW, it, it seems like anytime they try to fix something, they tend to make something worse. So we'll have to wait and see how this all pans out. Again... Actions speak louder than words. I like what the guy had to say, but until I see the change, I'm taking it all with a grain of salt. Um, if you watched the live stream, they kept throwing around the word great, like a lot. So my guess is the next big thing to come to the game is going to be another great one. And I believe I talked about this in my last video. About the uh, the hype. All right, let, let's pick him up and see what we got. A two twenty two point three diamond. That's that's a nice one. He's got he's got a chance. Well, he's a little small on the weight. A little small on the weight, but that's all right. We'll take him. So guys, I want to know from you in the comments. What do you want to see? For the next great one. Hey, keep in mind that they said that when they released the Whitetail, the Whitetail great one was going to be a non typical. That doesn't necessarily mean every great one that they come out with is going to be a non typical. So I'd like to know drop the comments. What do you want to see? What do you want to see as the next great one? I know it seems like a lot of people would like to see a mule deer. I get that. I'd be cool with that. Me personally, I would love to see a Great One Moose. I would love to see what they do with that. Um, a Great One Moose for me would just be awesome. Um, in my live stream, someone mentioned maybe a Great One Fallow Deer. I'd be okay with that. I think that would be a really cool looking animal that, that we could look forward to. Um, honestly, probably anything in the game would look good as a Great One. Uh, depending on how, how they did it. Because like I said... Not every great one has to be a non-typical. So, yeah, guys, let me know what you'd like to see. And with that, I think that's going to wrap this video. That's pretty much all I want to talk about. They didn't really talk about any new content. Obviously, they're not going to say anything about that. And, guys, it seems like any questions that are regarding a next-gen upgrade, the Call of the Wild... Uh, you know, the, uh, the, the the managers there, Jaxie, they're just going to skip over. They're, they're not going to pay attention to, they're not even going to ask. I'm, I'm starting to believe that EW tells their community managers what questions to just avoid. You know, because it seems like in every stream, there's questions that are asked constantly that they just won't touch with a 10-foot pole. And 
that definitely seems to be one of them. So, again, as soon as they drop new information, I will bring that to you. And I hope you guys enjoyed this video. If you did, smash that like button. Subscribe if you're not subscribed. I hope you're all having a fantastic day. And we'll see you next time.